Jim Hoffman here from EMS Office Hours, and this is your Monday Minutes. Uh, this is a special video uh, edition of Monday Minutes, and I just wanted to kind of highlight some of these 12 lead EKG help graphics over on the main website. And this is a quick overview. This is Monday Minutes, so we we'll go kind of quick here, but I just wanted to show you some of these graphics to kind of help you give you an idea and maybe refresh your memory a little bit as far as 12 lead EKG and lead placement and my STEMI locations and things like that. So here is a quick graph here. It just shows you the lead placement for V1 through V6 um, and shows you the intercostal spaces in relationship to where the leads are going to be placed on the body. The uh, other graphic here is just a quick picture of the heart and gives you an idea of the arteries, their locations, and relationship to where an MR might be uh, happening and then also help you a little bit understand as far as where it might be located when looking at the EKGs. Uh, the This graph here is a little bit uh, quick reference you can use and what it shows you is the lead placement where on the body it would be and what part of the heart it's looking at and this can help you when you're looking at any type of abnormalities in that lead lets you know what part of the heart is being affected um, in that EKG readout and finally this is another graph here again showing you the leads themselves and letting you know what part of the heart it's affecting, whether it's posterior, lateral, inferior, anterior, and what part of the actual artery even where it's uh, affecting as well, which so kind of like brings the, all three of those previous pictures together. So again, this is just a quick overview here. I encourage you to go check out the main site, look at these uh, graphs more in depth, and um, also you can even play back this video and pause it and whatnot to help you understand as well. Uh, there'll be a link below the video for the um, graphs and for this site and also on this page I've also have I have got a free download here for understanding uh, some basics as far as uh, looking at uh, EKGs as well as even a free uh, download for basic EKG reading as well on this site also so I hope you can use some of these Monday minutes um, if so we are at the page actually if you can just go ahead you can click the like button here and share it with uh, your peers if you feel something that they can benefit from and even comment and write directly on the page as well uh, for your Facebook friend and let them know that you found a quick little resource to help them with some 12 lead EKG uh, reading and again this is a quick overview nothing special here uh, just to kind of give you a reminder and maybe a quick little refresher so that when you actually have to do these skills and perform these tasks it's fresh in your mind and you don't have to second guess yourself uh, I hope you can use these Monday minutes again you have some Monday minutes of your own you want me to go ahead and highlight here be sure to send me an email it's Jay Hoffman at EMS-Safety.com. As always, Jim Hoffman from EMS Office Hours. Stay safe.